Welcome back to Cat Jungle. In the last episode, we created a hex bolt. In this episode, we're going to be creating a hex nut. We're going to actually do it in about seven easy steps. All right, let's jump right into it. First of all, let's create a new project. We're going to start a sketch on the top plane. Next, we're going to create a circumscribed polygon. We're going to give it about a 19 millimeter dimension. Next, we're going to constrain it to the vertical. All right, now it's fully constrained. We're going to go ahead and finish the sketch. And what we want to do is extrude it and give it about seven millimeter dimension, 7.1 millimeters to be exact. Okay. Now, we're going to go to the bottom. We're going to create a sketch on the bottom face. We're going to place a center circle on the bottom. We're going to drag it until it touches the very edge, until you see the triangle. That is basically the center point of the edge. And now it's also fully constrained. We're going to finish the sketch. And what we want to do with that circle is we also want to extrude it. So we're going to hit the E key. And we're going to drag it down just a tad. And what we want to do as far as the extent type, distance wise, we want it to go to all. Okay. We want to give it a 45 millimeter taper. Correction, 45 degree taper. All right. And we want it to intersect. Okay, and it gives us that shape. I'm going to click OK. All right, it's starting to come together. However, on the top face, we want that same exact shape. And to do that, we need to basically mirror it. But we don't have exactly a plane running through the middle. So what we need to do is construct a mid plane. And to do that, we'll select this bottom face, select this top face, and now it inserts a plane directly in the middle of a geometry. Click OK. All right. And now what we can do is mirror these faces on the opposite side. All right. So what we're going to do is create a mirror. Make sure faces is type is selected. We're going to select seven objects, which is basically going to be seven pieces of the, the outer edges, as well as the circle equals seven faces. So select that one and the outer edges. The mirror plane is going to be the plane we created. We're going to select OK. And as you can see, the bottom face is mirrored to the top. Now we can turn off that construction line. And the last thing we need to do is create the hole. And there's an easy way to do this. So basically, we're going to go to the top face. We're going to select the hole object. All right. This little icon right here, we can drag it around, but what we want to do is lock it in the center, move it around until it snaps into place. All right. Now let's set up the whole dimensions. Distance wise, we want it to go to all. The whole type is going to be countersunk. The whole tap type is going to be tapped. The thread offset is going to be full. And the drill point is going to be flat. The diameter is going to be 11 millimeters. The countersink angle is going to be 90 degrees. And that should be about it. 
it's going to be right hand direction and we want to make sure that model is checked we'll click OK and there you have it a simple boat and seven easy steps if you like this tutorial like and subscribe for the video and stay tuned for the next one